Good one. Flores, Command. You are clear to begin descent to surface. Copy. Disengaging. Initiating auxiliary thrusters. Command, we are 20 seconds to atmosphere breach. Initiate burn. Rotate on break. Primary ignition set to 30%. Rotating. We are engine first. Altitude 20,000 feet and falling. Mode 1. We are getting interference. Switch to high gain antenna. Command, confirm signal strength. You're looking great, Pod 1. Go for landing. Engines off. Pod 1 has landed. Almost looks like home. That's what worries me. Well, boss, you're ready. Got my truck. Want snipers at three and six, multiple defense lines, and an operating base established within the hour. Move! Goodman, a word. You know the stakes of this mission. Flores is already half dismantled. Our engine's on its way down to power a city of half a million. Now, if these outrider bozos hit pay dirt, you report to me first. Sir, I'm only here to answer a proper procedure this fall. We're not on Earth, Shearer. There is no proper procedure. Listen up, outriders. I know what you're all thinking. There's no going home. And no one has a clue what's waiting for us out there. But the ECA pencil heads can't green light this land until we find their missing probes. So let's do our job! ECA HQ to Outrider Alpha. Do you copy? This is Alpha Actual. Down at the spirits are messing with the radar. Can't get a lock on the probes. Negative HQ. Our systems are all functioning. We'll set up camp further up. We're looking at the camp for further instructions. HQ, can you repeat? I'm gonna scout ahead on foot. Need to stretch my damn legs. I'll take point. Don't need to see you get eaten on day one. Relax, Outrider. You don't owe me anything. I wouldn't be here without you. I'd be buried in the ashes back home. Hey. No matter what happens out here, I need my best gun on this in case things go south. I cannot depend on you. Just tell me what to do, Cap. Our weapons haven't been fired in nearly a century. Why don't you head over to Jacob and get your gear checked, and then be prepared to move out as soon as those probes are located. Any questions? No word from Earth, I assume? It's really gone. She went dark 15 years into our journey. More or less as predicted. ECA's confirmed no communication since. <laughs> Shit. You know, I uh, grew up a slum dog, fighting for scraps. Lost everyone, really. Long before the end. Doomsday just wasn't a thing I worried about. Hell, it was never gonna live past 20 anyway. Somehow. I was one of the ones who made it. Don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing here. As things go right, time's coming, you're gonna have to leave all that behind. This is a new beginning. You could have a family here. Build a cabin. Grow old and get fat. That's not me, Cap. Know my way around bullets, not kids. There's gonna be no need for someone like me here. Maybe the old you, Outrider. But you're one of the chosen few. You get to build the future. Don't waste it. I'll go find Jakob's shooting range. Good. We're on standby for those probes, so stay on alert.
Hey, Cuthbert, any updates? The probe signal is mostly noise, but I've tracked its source. There. Hope you all brought your galoshes. Ooh. Jakob, mm. same shit, different planet. Ochevishcha. <laughs> Electronics are freezing up. Trucks are down. We continue on foot. Soldier, your primary focus is here. Understand? We keep moving. Eyes up. Choke on your own spit, dude. It's nothing, I'm good. Jesus. Shit. Oh, back to the ship. Alert the medics. What's going on? Hey, stay back. Tanner, got eyes on the probe. I got movement, heading in. Tanner, I found it. Good work. Get the drive, so get the hell out. Wait, hold on. This thing's just in relay mode. Tanner, the signal isn't coming from the probe. It's coming from outside our search zone, somewhere else on the planet. That's impossible. There is nobody else. Secure the hard drive. We'll analyze that signal back at base. Copy. Oh, damn it! Something's frying it, Tanner. Give us the frequency. Uh, carrier frequency is nine, seven point. Tanner, do you copy? Shit. Tanner, Tanner, I'm seeing some really strange shit down here. Ah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
casualties, possible contamination. I need quarantine, set up a base, you copy? Uh, uh, shit. Maxwell, what the fuck is all this? What does it look like? Sergeant Major, sir, we have to follow quarantine procedure and hold the landing. Whatever the original reports about this planet, they were wrong. There's some kind of anomaly. If we land now, everyone will die. There's no holding the landing. It's too late for that. There's nowhere else to go. <laughs> Tanner here! We need help! <laughs> We need medics! See to them! Hurry! No, stop. They're contaminated. We contain them. That's an order. You always were an asshole. Look around you! We got men and women in need of medical attention! Now get your asses in gear and do the right thing, or I'm gonna have to... No! Contain this! Now! Burn the fucking bodies! Do the right thing! Call it in! Postpone the fucking landing! It's too late. Hey, you! Can you help me with the wounded? We have to get them to Metla. Over here! Come on, move your asses! Almost there. Uh, we're gonna be fine. Okay, here. Make it happen! What are you doing? I'm putting you back into cryo until MedLab can save your fucking life. Don't be ridiculous. I'm done for. Pep talks aren't really my thing. When is something truly over? Was it when your people left Earth behind? Was it when you watched the first spaceship crash and burn? Was it when you saw your fellow Outriders crumble at your feet? Was it watching yourself die? But Enoch isn't done with you yet, Outrider. Like I always say, it ain't over till it's over. You, what year are you from? Year, what year? What? Is this your pod? Where were the uplink nodes? Come on, Doc. We need to go. They're coming. Wait, we can't just leave them here. These are outriders. They're not why we're here. I'm sorry.
your blood, your stink of Enoch. Your kind are abominations, exile. Who the hell are you? Outrider. Impossible. Such untapped power, such confusion. You want answers. Whatever you were before, you're something new now. A second life. Don't waste it. Who... Who was that? Lord Seth? He's... He's altered. And he's a little man. A little man. Altered? What the fuck does that mean? You... <laughs> you don't know what you are. <laughs> Where'd you steal that uniform? Didn't. It's mine. Yeah? If he's really an outrider, then you fight's in the wrong side. Altered. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the Grand Marshal, she'll explain. Come. Where is she? There. There. What is that? Go, go, go. Do whatever you have to do, Lieutenant. Shira? You're alive. I'm sorry to disappoint you. You came from their side. You got any intel for us? Are you fucking kidding me? Look, I got a war to win, so either you help me or you get back into cryo. Hold on. I've just woken up to mud and shit. I've been asleep for God knows how many years. 31 years. So for 31 years, I've been seeing people fight and die while you were getting comfy in cryo. So excuse me for not throwing you a little welcome party. What happened to you? The anomaly. That's what happened. You mean that storm? We told them not to land. Anything more advanced than a grease engine got fried. All our data wiped out. We couldn't grow crops or make medicine. So we ended up in the same place as when we left Earth. Just killing each other over the little we have left. Why didn't you go somewhere else? The Outriders could have... The Outriders are dead. What? And the anomaly keeps us in this fucking valley. We can't go anywhere else. You don't get it, do you? You think you're dreaming? This is real. Believe me, it's fucking real. So whether you like it or not, you're stuck here in the mud and shit like the rest of us. You should have never woken up. Why didn't miss out on all this? Grand Marshal, we were too late. The hounds have him. He's been taken underground. Well, get him back. Well, it may be our side, but that's not our turf, ma'am. I'm not losing people over Yakub. Yakub? He's still alive? Not for much longer, it seems. Then I'll go find him. Ma'am? Ma'am? Never mind. We've got it covered. Nice eyes. <laughs> hey! Whoa. Oh, sorry, guys. I thought this was the bathroom. You okay? I had it under control. Been a while. Do I know you? <laughs> Kurva! Then I thought you were dead. You'll soon be dead if you don't get your ass to Shears right now. Uh, sure up. All right. Come meet me there when you're ready. No, because he won't. Because he can do what the fuck he wants. Hey. Never been so happy to see a familiar face. You haven't aged a day. You got old, my friend. In the hallway, that was Seth. What was he doing here? Ignoring our pleas for help. I thought it was on your side. <laughs> Seth, he's not on anyone's side. 
The insurgents have altered their walking nightmares. We're lucky Seth shows up to fight them back sometimes, but only if it fits whatever the hell game he's playing. Hey, damn it. You have no idea how bad it is, Outrider. We thought we escaped the apocalypse. We thought we could start over again here. But we were wrong. I was wrong. Shira. Do you know why I'm in charge? Because I'm the only officer left alive. The insurgents at our door, they're feral, sadistic. They have us surrounded. We're low on food and bullets. And if those freaks don't kill us, this planet will. Welcome back. The black fungus in the forest. We never found a cure. The mountains are filled with abominations. And the anomaly storms get bigger every year. We don't have much time left. If we don't find a way out of this valley, if we don't find a miracle, this last shred of humanity is over. Shira. <laughs> well, would you look at that? I can do things now. I don't understand, but maybe there's a reason. Yes, you are. I guess I know why I saved your damn life all those years ago. I'm sure this isn't exactly what you had in mind. I'm not complaining. Still, I don't get in. The day we landed, that storm, it tore Cuthbert apart, but not me. Why? Why was I- Altered? Who the hell knows? When those storms hit, some get ripped inside out, some turn pink polka dot, and a few come back. Fucking immortal. Nothing about the anomaly makes sense. It disrupts the laws of nature. It mutates whatever it touches. Early on, the ECA's best scientists tried to understand the storms, to tame them. None survived. I guess you got lucky, boss. <laughs> or maybe not. All I care about is that you are on our side. Our only supply line is blocked by an altar that our weapons cannot touch. Out by the old solar array. Seth had no interest in helping us, but now, you're here. Hell, why not? Maybe I can buy humanity another day. Lieutenant, what the hell was that? The whole front line just collapsed! Like an earthquake, all right? I, I, I think we lost our whole first line of defenses! On my way. Go, go, go! Hey, in case I don't get another chance, I, I tried to find you, but it all went to shit. We had to run for our lives. I just... Forget it. I'm alive. We should have been dead ten times over, if not for Tanner, if not for Shira. I'm the one with dues to pay now, Yakum. Boss! I missed you. It's good to have you back. Now go beat that altered ass for us. So we can get back in this goddamn fight. First kill. We also do not die so easily, do we? Seth. Come. We must speak. They asked you to help them. To fight the altar down there. Why didn't you? 
That pathetic monstrosity was a distraction. People are dying because of him. Without the supply route open... They all die. These feeble creatures. Slaughtering each other over scraps. You waste your gifts. Running errands for them. Trying to win their meaningless, en endless war. You must realize... You are not like them anymore. So what? I should play at being a god like you. I... am not playing. But you... are something even more. Altered and Outrider. The last Outrider. Do what you were sent here for! Go! Beyond the frontier! These people need their gods. Only one like you could lead them to a future. Why not you? They call him Moloch. I fight another war, far above this petty squalor. My war is with the worst of our kind. This one is too powerful. He will destroy us all, unless I hunt him down. But this is not your fight. You are to be the shepherd. Find a way for them out of this slaughter. Outrider. Sure, it's done. Your supply line's open, I'm heading home. I don't believe you. They do, Peck. Yeah, good. Sure. The signal in the forest. You remember it? Yeah, like it was yesterday. You still have its frequency, don't you? You mean this frequency? Curve. You got the winning lotto numbers tattooed on your ass cheek, too? Still don't believe me? Ugh, I hate when you play the I told you so. That signal is still playing like a distant echo. It's digital, which means it must be coming from a place where there is no anomaly. The problem is, we've never been able to locate its source because we've never had the right frequency. Until you showed up. So now, listen close, you need to bring those precise numbers to Dr. Abraham Zahidi, one of our last scientists. Bullshit. He's been deep in enemy territory for weeks now. Five rations says Zahidi's dead. We don't know that. You... I've seen you before, it was... in the med lab. You woke me out of cryo. Guess life's real funny that way. Meet Jane, sniper, first class. She almost died trying to save his life. She'll guide you. Wait, Shira. When we landed, that signal was already playing. Do you have any idea who or what is sending it? Do yourself a favor. Don't ask that question. Whatever's out there, they don't want to be found. And whoever goes looking for that fucking signal ends up dead. But it's the only chance we've got. And if anyone can get there alive, it's all of you. Shira, come on. Jakob! I that's in order. Sorry I left you to die in that med lab. Hey, no worries. Didn't really have a choice. <laughs> I'd have done the same. And again, Dobrowski has outdone himself. Whoa. <laughs> You've managed to keep my truck working after all these years? Well, I had to strip the AI systems, bypass the graphene cells, cost me 20 bottles of vodka and parts, but now I'll be able to run on anything. Diesel, turpentine, even fucking potatoes, if we could grow potatoes. You still got tunes? Tunes? Hey boss, we got no electronics. No tunes, no nothing. But somehow we make do. Get 
Get back! I'll kill him! Calm down. Not a step closer, I swear. Rip him open! Get back! <laughs> This man's gonna bleed out. Who are you? Shira Goodman sent me to find you. Thought you might want to see this. That's a frequency. What the? Where did you get? Where? Jane! You're hurt! It's nothing, Doc. Tell me the briefcase is safe. Oh, the truck is gone. I... Oh, the fuck. Wait, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, 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 listen to me, listen to me. I might be able to stop the bleeding, but you have to tell me where your people took my truck. I will save your life. Promise? Yes. Go down past river. All right, Doc, move back. Wait, no, 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 no. I just gave this man my word. We can't leave him alive. He knows too much. No, he doesn't have to die. We already have what we want. James! No! Oh, God. Oh, God. Get her up. I'm taking her back to my truck. No! You have to find the Doc's truck. It's more important than me. You have no idea. There's a briefcase under the oil tank. Bring it back safe. Make me dig my own grave next. This better be worth it. Oh my god. Still intact? The satellite uplink. The last satellite uplink. So that's what you were looking for when you found me? Yeah. And it still works? How? The case, it's mu metal. It insulates. It, it's never been opened, so the electronics inside have been safe from the goddamn anomaly. So what does it connect to? Flores. I thought it was all disassembled for the colonization. Mostly. But we lost contact towards the end. Half of the resources we were meant to have are still up there. They're trapped in the supply pods. Seeds, electronics, hard drives full of data, all out of reach. We could rebuild civilization with those resources, but they're useless to us unless we can find a place beyond the storms. No. It might sound like a dream, but for those of us that believed, it kept us going. So this is it. That's why Shira sent me to get you. She wants what's inside those pots. So what do we do now? Your frequency. I can use it to locate the source of the signal. I need to reach an antenna up high somewhere. You got one in mind? Yeah. yeah. Eagle Peaks. But, uh, not yet. I told you. Everyone who goes on this stupid mission ends up dead. Is that the tower? Yes, it looks like the cable car's down. We might ask those soldiers if there's a way to get them working. What the hell was that noise? How about they keep the engine warm?
Hold it. The signal. That's... No, we're too far away. There's too much interference from the anomaly and the coordinates. But I have a direction. What is it? It's either in the forest or somewhere beyond. What aren't you telling me? Nobody's ever come back alive from the forest. Yeah, I figured you're gonna say something like that. Listen. You hear that? Something's under the city. Jakob, prepare the truck. We're heading towards the forest. Oh, the forest? Of course. Driving into savage, uncharted territory and breathing a fungus that liquefies your organs was on my list of things to do today. You know, if I had a fucking nickel for every time... Maybe we switch the radio off for a little while. No, I got it. I got it. So, we've got a problem. Insurgents have taken the quarry, and the only road headed east has been mine. There's no way through unless we talk to Corrigan. He's the Grand Marshal up in Trenchtown, and he is an unknown for being generous to strangers. Fortunately, I told that charming young lady out there that we were headed east, and now... Don't she... tell people where we're going. Right, I wouldn't normally, but it turns out she's Corrigan's associate. She'll give us an intro if we help her drive up a package. Well, what kind of package? <clears throat> Try anything, girly, and your short, pathetic life is over. Oh, it ain't over till it's over, sweetheart. <laughs> you. Who are you? Chana? <laughs> I go to the end of the fucking world, and you're still in my fucking face? <sighs> go drown in your bottle. Asshole. Why am I not surprised to see you in chains again? <laughs> that girl. Is she a friend of yours? Someone from a long time ago. Any reason she hates your gut so much? Many. Let's go. Buckle up. We're moving out. Oh, Ryder. And so, you gather your flock. Again. Hey, keep your trap shut. Where do I find this Corrigan? The big bunker. I'll let him know you're coming. Though your kind's pretty hard to miss. So. This is Gutman's new altered. She sent you to intimidate me? Aren't you both on the same side? <laughs> to 
today. I just need passage through your minefield. I don't want to waste my You're time. You're a prisoner. What did you do? My fortune teller predicted victory. And my men walked into an ambush. I told you what you wanted to hear. I can't it's the fucking visions. I've told you Sick of your bullshit. <laughs> we fight tomorrow with no altered at our side. You've got serious issues. You have an altar right here. You will fight with his men tomorrow, yeah? Just let the girl go. I don't have time for this. Who the hell is she to you? She's like some kind of daughter to me. Oh, oh hold on. Y you had a daughter? Nah. Maybe more like I was screwing her mom for a couple of years, and maybe her aunt. Facts are blurry. Uh, I like this arrangement very much. They want the passage east and the witch. Fine. <laughs> you would take Seth's place in battle? Wait. Seth is here? The Great Altered was last seen out in the wreckage zone, hunting one of your kind. Then I'll go find him. You do that. The assault's tomorrow at dawn. If I'm to give up my oracle, I expect to see one of you back here, or our deal is... Yeah, on. yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Leave the truck again, and I'll roll you to the wheel. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Jakob, Seth's dead. What? He's never been defeated. You see, we call him Moloch. Jacob, there's another altered out here. Someone more powerful than Seth. Well, that's just fucking awesome. We shall see victory! A great new altar fights at our side! Together, we shall fuck them up! Go! Move, move! Piece of junk coming? Hey, at least better than kissing the sergeant's ass. <sighs> Give me that. What is that anyway? That's from the old world. Well, you wouldn't understand. You can't even fucking read. <laughs> Sorry, Grandma. It's not a fucking library. Report. Hey! My grandma was a general. Shut the fuck up, man. You didn't know your grandma. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Did you see that? My fight's not with you. Oh, it is now. You fight with them. That means you die with them. down and what will be left without us
That's how you thank a girl for saving your life? I knew my fortune teller was gold. She saw exactly where you were buried. I'm done, you said. A deal's a deal. You're free to go. Your shit prophecies can be someone else's problem. The assault. Tell me this pounding headache was worth it. <laughs> the news is good. Of course, it was a bloodbath. But while you were entertaining that abomination, we took back the front. Are you sure I can't entice you to stay? Life is good around here for the altered. The glory of battle. Women, men, worshippers at your feet. Thanks. I'm somewhere I gotta be. East? The quarry's overrun. Past that's the edge of the world. What does Gutman have you looking for? Passage through the minefield. That was our deal. Marshal Bailey knows the way. She'll see your convoy through. What? No fucking way! Guide us over radio, draw a map. We are not taking her. We? I never said you were coming. <laughs> I'd say you always had a home here altered. But I don't think you'll be coming back alive. Did you piss off? I don't need anyone else to babysit. I can take care of myself. Not where we're going. Hey, just wait! It ain't over till it's over. Jenna! Did you just... It's how I know I'm supposed to go with you. The anomaly fucked me up too. But I only get the visions. Always horrible visions all my life. Except one. And that's beautiful. It's this planet, but it's lush, and it's green, it's, it's in the future. And there's always someone there with me. I could never see the face, but the voice, it's you. Whatever it is you're doing, I know it's gonna work, because in the end, we're in that meadow together. Oh, hell no! I'm not going anywhere with that bitch. Jana can't come with us. That wasn't the deal. In the truck, both of you. Chanda, what do you think you're doing? Chanda! Chanda, listen to me for once. Where I am taking these two, there's no coming back. I didn't save your life again. Watch you throw it all away. <laughs> That's what you're telling yourself now? You're my savior? It's pathetic. Fine. Next time you're in trouble, I won't think twice. I'll let you die, you stupid cow. Well, you gotta die somewhere. And if it's out there, at least I get to watch you go first. John. So long, fuckers. You're heading back across the minefield on. Better than where you're headed. Have fun getting yourselves killed. That's it. The quarry. Got a plan to get us through alive. We have to make some modifications to the truck. You're not touching the truck. We have to seal the interior. Then with lithium perchlorate to generate oxygen and iron powder and lithium hydroxide to scrub CO2. English, please. The truck will be like a bubble. And we'll be safe inside so long as we have lithium to generate oxygen. That'll give us time to find the source of the signal. Would you expect me to magically pour more lithium out of my ass when our supply runs out? I can do without the Snyder marks. 
The only source of lithium on Enoch comes from old batteries from Earth. Now, most of them were scavenged for parts long ago, but the mining operation's been inaccessible for years. There's bound to still be some of them around here. Simply put, we find the batteries, we get to live. Oh, better and better. Let's move. I don't think that, uh... You just got real lucky, old man. What if she comes with us? If we make it through, someone has to keep the briefcase and me safe when you're not around. Look, old man, I don't do charity work. No, no, please, we need you. Give me a break. She's playing us. This is her way of weaseling her way into our troop. She's spying for Corrigan. You see that in your crystal ball? Admit it, you psychopath. <laughs> you know I'm right. You couldn't pay me enough of whatever prize you're after, freak. I'm tracking a signal that's coming from beyond the anomaly. When we find it, we're gonna reconnect to the floors and bring down those lost supply pods. Keep Dr. Zahidi alive and keep your stupid mouth shut and you'll get your share of the loot. Deal. Fucking believable. I know, I know, she's a pain in the ass. But, uh, if you lay a hand on her ever again, I'll run you over with this goddamn truck. We got one shot at this. But let's be honest. Anyone who follows me out there today is probably gonna die. And we'll all be home for Christmas. How do I keep getting myself into this shit? isn't in this way, it can't. <laughs> Is that what your magic fucking fairy vision say? Because it sure as hell doesn't look like we're getting out of here and... What? No, 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 it's okay. Something happened. Who the hell are you? <coughs> hey, 
Where are you taking us? Who the hell are you people? All your questions will be answered when we reach Dr. Skurlock. <coughs> it's too late. We're not making it to any doctor. Stand down, or your people will die! You fucking die with them! I'm not threatening them, asshole! I'm trying to save them! What exactly is in this? Please, please, uh, do, do not fear. My name is Nathan Skurlock, Xenobiology. Uh, Dr. Abraham Zahidi, can you explain to Zahidi. us what... Oh my, what an unexpected honor. I was a follower of your father's work, um, at least um, as long as was possible. I haven't so much claim to fame. But as you can see, there is one breakthrough of mine that has served us rather well. Just tell us how it works. Um, yes, yes, of course. My apologies. Um, the fungus wasn't always like this. Its DNA was altered. My formula merely tells the fungus against itself. Here, all who are brave enough to reach us are free to live in peace. My antidote must be injected daily. None of us dare stay far away from camp without it. We have a small ceremony each month. We're just in time for one. No alters, I'm afraid. I hope that the rest of your convoy will attend this evening. We're not planning on staying long. Oh, beyond here, there's only death. Until the truck is repaired, we're stuck here anyway. Good. Thank you. Screw till they push back, then loosen a little. You forget everything I taught you. Taught me? You think you taught me anything, old man? Unbelievable. Feisty. She definitely got her temper from you. Looks like we're taking a break. I guess you've earned the right to hear the full story. So, uh, a long time ago, before this shitty planet, before we even left Earth. I was flying workers to the Caravel Orbit Station. I, the flames started to surround me and I tried to find an exit. And that's when I tripped and I saw this damn pregnant woman lying under the rubble. I was able to save both of us. Well, sir, hold on. You were there during the Caraval disaster? All the survivors of the Caraval were given a free ticket aboard the brand new Flores, and I, I met her again. <laughs> right here, in Trench Town. Her child was born. It was a girl. And she named her Chanda. That that little brand was only six when she saw her mother killed right in front of her. So you raised her. Come on. The truck isn't going to fix itself. you make it out this far alive, even less mean to keep going. What is it you're looking for, friend? I'm not your friend. You don't know what's out there. There are things I could tell you, things I could warn you about, but you would not believe these things. And what makes you so sure? Because the things I've seen, even I do not believe them. That was Skurlock's little ceremony? 
How was it? It was weird. A bunch of rambling speeches about brotherhood. We all picked stones from a basket. And hey, there was music and drugs, so not all bad. Where's Zahidi? Went off with Scurlock talking some science mumbo-jumbo. Well, he'll be back. No, he won't. Your friend picked the Black Stone. What are you talking about? They're taking him to the facility. Get me out of here. I'll lead you. Skurlock makes his antidote here. Very few know what goes on inside. And how do you? I used to help him make it. Until he took a friend of mine prisoner. Stop! Hey, how you doing? I'd like to see Dr. Zahidi. Please. This facility is off limits! You will not get a second warning! People. That's what they injected us with. He needed bone marrow for the antidote to work. All those people who escaped the war came here to die instead. And I was next. You think that was easy for me, Doctor? It's random. It has to be. Except for you. Safe from your own lottery, I suppose. How convenient. I create the antidote. I keep us alive. How many exactly have you sacrificed for your little utopia? I am not a monster. I carry the burden. A few must be sacrificed so many can live. Ah! Ah! What are you going to choose who lives and dies? I don't hide behind a basket of stones. When I kill a man, he knows it was me. No. Take as much as you can carry. You didn't have to kill him. He was a man of science. There's so few of us left. He was a self-righteous murderer. What does that make me, then? His antidote, God help me, we're still gonna use it. You haven't yet seen anything. Oh, August. That? A native of Enoch. I found August out there, lost and alone. I tried to give shelter, but Skurlock only saw a specimen to experiment. This. this changes everything. Please. No more. He can talk. Oh, God, please. August, it's all right. They're not like the others, they're friends. Friend? Diago. Okay, you're free now. Go home. Get Dr. Zahidi back to my truck.
Move out. Right away. East. There's a ravine to the east. You'll have to go south around it. You know this forest? I've gone further than anyone else. I'm not a deserter. I came into this forest because I'm an explorer. A voyager. Like you, Outrider. We're heading beyond the anomaly. Don't know if we'll be coming back, but... We could use a guide. Kurva. This become a regular clown car. My god. We'll have to report this to Gutman. Can't believe we've been next to an alien civilization all these years. In this case, aren't we the aliens? These ruins are ancient. If big like the ones we saw sent the signal, it wasn't from here. Are you sure we're still heading in the right direction? Honestly, Outrider, I don't know. But if you can get a receiver above this tree line, we should be close enough to pick up the trail again. I know of a structure. Give me a radio, I can... Others, we need to find shelter. In there, August, you came back! What exactly is your friend doing? Bailey! Fuck! Look at this fucking thing! It's making the fucking storm! No, wait! It's not what you think! August can channel it! Control it! Look! August is helping us! No shit! Bailey! You need to stand down! No, I don't think so. Think maybe I've gone far enough on your little death march. Think I'm going back to Corrigan and taking this freak with me. Come here! Be careful. We don't know what this energy could do to you. <laughs> oh no. Go. Go! Really? You don't want to do this. You could not be more wrong, freak. No! You don't win this! Spinal cords most likely severed. If she survives, she'll never walk again. Good. She can watch the monsters eat her liver. Let's go. No reason to leave her to suffer. No! I, I, I don't care what she's done. We need to bring... I, I will take care of her 
personally, I... I would do the same for any of you. Really? Okay. Now the no bullshit version. My vision of the meadow. I've been seeing more of it. Bailey's in it. How's it supposed to come true if she's not with us? In your vision, is everyone there? I don't know. Have you told him? He doesn't listen to anything I say. Hold up. Movement in the trees behind us. It's Kay. Probably wants his revenge. Now nah, you can get in line. Everything we've been hoping for is right behind this gate, but there's no obvious mechanism for opening it. August, you must know yet. Lost people. You mean there's others like you? Maybe. What do you mean? You know what's out there? Our only hope? It's the end of the goddamn world out there. What happened to a place beyond the storms, huh? We are about to go farther than any man has ever gone before. Oh. Well, let's go! Before I change my fucking mind. Mr. Spock. Crazy Vulcan. Looks like we may be here a while. <sighs> Need to drink, you stupid bitch. Mm. Hey, she's waking up! Hey. Hey. How do you feel? You've been out a few days. Whoa, 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 whoa. I... I can't... I can't feel my legs. I'm sorry, Bailey. Why didn't you just kill me? Dada. My masterpiece. The Braski has outdone himself again. What? What did I do now? Oh. I thought my daughter wanted you to live. For God knows the reason. Kill me? Or get out of my face? Shut up! Is that a fire out there? 
seems we're not alone. Warn the others. I'll go check it out. What the fuck? Lord Gratwick! What the hell? Jakob, the light was an ambush. Some real uglies that were drawing me out. Did you copy? Jakob! Oh my god! What the fuck? Give me a tear! August! Us do nothing! Us hide! Now friends! Taken! Taken? Yes! They took them? Yes! Alive? Yes! For... To eat them! Us no us take. Hurry. August, wait. Take this. Us cannot. Or else like them. Stay in the truck. I'll find them. What the fuck? Hey! <clears throat> they took Chana to the fire pits. You know, I always thought the old cockroach could survive anything. My mom always told me he was the only outrider on Enoch, still alive. He even escaped the wreck of the caravel back when the Earth was dying, she said. 
classic. <laughs> but why him? You know? What was his magic charm? <sighs> I always thought I was just not giving a shit about any of it. Like it protected him. Well, uh, hey. Guess he finally gave a shit about something. <laughs> well, well. Can you believe it? Turns out the old man's chair on wheels is a uh, really practical. It's only going to get worse the further we go. If anybody wants to go back, do it now. But I got one mission. I'm finding that signal. You're going to need a driver. Our trucks, but none of our expeditions made it out of the forest alive. How is this even possible? If they came from the forest, they're going the wrong way. No, look closer. This isn't us. The enemy, then? Oh my god, is that some kind of fuel cell? I've never seen tech this advanced before. Who the hell were they? Whoever they were, they lost. This was a massacre. We can't stay here. Jenna, we need to find shelter. We head to those rocks. I didn't think we'd make it out of that storm. That's no storm. Look! There's someone out there. Wait, isn't that the son of a bitch that killed Jakob? Man, you're really good at pissing people off. This fuck's not letting this go. Neither am I. Next time I see him, he's dead. Up here, I found something. Some kind of outpost. Looks human. You see that antenna over there? I can use it to trace the signal. You hear that? It's a digital relay device. What the hell is it supposed to be relaying? Our signal. Our signal? Is them? But how was it playing when it landed? How is that even possible? It's not. It's not possible. Only one interstellar ship ever left Earth. Ours. Then who were they? Doesn't matter. Those coordinates. We find them, we plug in, and we contact the damn Flores. August. What happened here? Incoming! Get out of there! 
there! Now! Shit. Hide! In there! Go! to August. August's people weren't wiped out by savages. They became savages. Why would they do that? <laughs> this Monroy was a madman. Hey, there's a ship! Who's that? The Caravel? That's not possible. The Caravel never left Earth. Its engines exploded. Its engines exploded. Tens of thousands died. Then what the hell are we looking at? The source of the fu fucking signal. The Monroy signal. There's no place beyond the storm. It's coming from in there, protected from the anomaly, just like the uplink in your goddamn briefcase. I don't fucking... I don't fucking understand. Neither do I. It doesn't make any sense. Everyone saw the caravel explode during its construction. Even if the people left on Earth were able to rebuild the ship, they left after us. We were the... F we were the first. Nevertheless, what's certain is that Monroy enslaved August's people. He butchered them, and they turned. 
They mutated into savages willingly, so they could fight back, back. I'm done with all this. Whatever's waiting for you on that ship, I want no, I want no part of it. Tiago, you can't leave us now. I thought you weren't a deserter. What they did to August's people. What our people did to August, don't you see? Thank you for letting me walk away with you. We're going to finish this. We're finding a way into the caravan. as I saw it, as we saw it. Jaina, that's not real. That's this planet, all right, but it's long gone. No. No, it's... get the fuck off! It's... so many times. Never you. Who are you? Who am I? <laughs> Monroy. Roy? Hmm. How? How did you, how did this ship get here before us? How do you think? left us to die as the earth crumbled. But I don't die so easy, do I? <laughs> now we built a, a new engine. An engine that, that shamed all others before it. So, so while you were still crawling through deep space, we were already here. <laughs> oh, you should have seen it. Their primitive civilization, the natives, they treated us like gods. Yeah. I've seen what you did to the natives. See now, this isn't a rescue. Why didn't you come when we sent out the distress call? Huh? Thirty years since the Flores arrived in our skies. Thirty years surviving in this hell. This hell was because of you. My entire life trapped in that valley, slowly slaughtering each other for nothing. You robbed our people of hope before we even got here. Now don't flatter yourselves. You are as capable of every wickedness. The Pax weren't as docile as they looked. They had powers. So much power. Things I had to understand. So you just rounded them up? You tortured them, you son of a bitch. Are you really so naive? How long before those creatures tired of us? Before they turned against us? They would have had us on our bloody knees. Oh, 
All that I wanted was their powers. For, for us. For all of us. So that we could survive. So we could be strong. Don't you see? We lost the Earth. Because we were meant for something more. But for the grace of I go you, my child. Do you think that you would be standing there with the powers of a god if it hadn't been for me? <laughs> All that I've done for humanity. I saved us. You cursed us. But I won. It's done. Fuck him. No more wasting time. I have to tap the uplink into the Caravel's power so we can reach the floor as before we... Shit. We found this. We gotta go. No, 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 no. Leave me. I have to do this. Do what you gotta do, Doc. That door won't hold long. Outrider, if that beast cracks this ship's hull, we lose electronics, we lose the pods, we lose everything. I'll, I'll take care of it. You just get those pods down. Sahidi! What's happening in there? It's working! I've contacted the Flores, transmitting the first launch codes. Now! God damn it, Doc! We can't hold them! Place is gonna blow! Almost there. Almost there! signal, the uplink, it was all for nothing. Wait, guys, look, over there. The pods, it, it works? Did it. My God. I guess some of the commands went through after all. Well, like I always say, it ain't over till it's over. <laughs> Are you the Outriders? 
We heard tales about an altered outriders opening the frontier, finding a cure in the forest. We've been following your trail since the war zone. Keep moving. They did it. 